Every single day, but also as yeah. the current chairman of the American Fly Fishing Trade Association, the trade group that represents the entire fly fishing industry throughout America. For the record, our industry is completely united in its opposition to the development of the Pebble Line project, and we believe that Bristol Bay Watershed, as the home to the largest salmon runs in North America and the world, is a one-of-a-kind resource that cannot be put at risk. The American Fly Fishing Trade Association agrees with the EPA's scientific review findings that Pebble Mine is a threat to Bristol Bay. A project that proposes to spew up to 10 billion tons of toxic mining waste that would theoretically be stored behind massive earthen dams up to 50 stories tall, all in a known earthquake zone, is quite simply an environmental disaster that is waiting to happen. To construct and dig one of the world's largest open pit mines in the heart of such an ecologically sensitive and economically significant area is the worst possible nightmare for the Alaskan wilderness, for the people who live and work throughout the area, and for the countless businesses and jobs that are directly and indirectly linked to the Bristol Bay region. The foreign-owned consortium that wants to mine the Pebble area would have you believe that opposition to their project comes from the standard no mining, no development, zero extraction attitudes of radical environmentalism. As a business owner and lifelong sportsman, I am here to tell you that nothing could be further from the truth. Watching these slides and reading the report, when you see facts up there that say leakage of acidic drainage, likely. Failure of road culverts, likely. Thanks. Thanks. Pipeline failures Thanks. under these Thanks. toxic slurry, likely. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> 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 That's funny.